Dexcom has been transforming diabetes management since its founding in 1999. They continued on the foundational work of Stort Updike in the late 1960s, who dreamed of an implantable device that would read glucose numbers continuously and then transmit them to an external receiver. Similar in some way to Sensionic sensor that's currently available, but without an externally worn external transmitter device. Dexcom took that work from an implantable device and developed the first externally worn, commercially available, real-time CGM. This was called the STS-3. This stood for short-term sensor and then the 3 for 3 days. This short-term sensor launched in 2006 and it marked a significant leap forward because it provided real-time glucose data every five minutes. Before this, we only had the Medtronic Gold professional unit that was blinded to patients. Now we have a, a real-time sensor that's visible to the patient. And Dexcom continued to innovate from there with the, the 7, the G4, the G5, the G6, now the G7. And this continually pushed the boundaries of convenience and accuracy in glucose monitoring. So what we have now is really exciting. Dexcom unveiled the Stello sensor, which is available over the counter without a prescription, and it's a game changer in more ways than just that one. It's designed specifically for individuals managing pre-diabetes or type 2 diabetes without insulin. Stello offers a 15-day wear period. That's a, that's a lot longer than the G7's 10-day period, along with a stickier adhesive that I think really is what allows that 15 day wear instead of the 10. So what sets Stello apart is also it's reduced alerts and they're tailored for non-insulin users with a shorter warm up period for the sensor and making it more user friendly for those managing their condition through lifestyle changes rather than insulin. It also has a really innovative app. It provides education, and recommendation features I hope we see carry over into the G line of sensors that, that we have now. It's priced pretty competitively too at $99 or if you signed up for a monthly membership for the year, it's $89 a month. And that gets you two sensors that each last 15 days so there you have a full month with just two sensors. Stella is also fully waterproof and it's most importantly very easy to get because it's over the counter, which means you don't need a prescription. This really expands Dexcom's broader mission to improve the accessibility of CGM technology. This ensures that more people than ever can benefit from continuous glucose monitoring without the barriers of getting a prescription or, quite honestly, the higher costs that come along with sensors. Imagine how big that could impact the eight and a half million people that live in the United States right now that are undiagnosed with diabetes, if they had a low cost option that they could just go to the store, put it on and get an idea of what their glucose is doing and whether they really need to see a professional. So Stello isn't just another device. It's a tool designed to empower users with real time data and allowing them to make informed decisions about their health. This proactive approach is perfectly aligned with the patient-centered care model that Dexcom champions. Putting the patient in control of their health journey, you, you can't have something more important than that. You know, the more that you do for yourself and the more tools you have to be able to do those things really moves healthcare in the United States forward. So from Stored Updike's early vision to the cutting edge Stello sensor we have available today, Dexcom's evolution is really a testament to relentless innovation. And to be fair, it's a testament to the CGM class as a whole because both Abbott and Dexcom move their sensors forward every year with making things better, smaller, faster, you know, more accurate, easier to use. So it's really exciting. So I look forward to seeing Abbott's lingo and Rio that was approved by the FDA earlier this year as over-the-counter sensors come to market next. The future of diabetes management is evolving quick, and we haven't yet found a cure for diabetes, but until that time, we can do everything we can do to make identifying and managing this disease easier. Oh.